Some people want to see your nice side so, so they can be comfortable enough to disrespect you, so, so they can be comfortable enough to try to poke you, you know, look for weaknesses. You know, they want to find some kind of leverage over you so they be nice and to hope, hope, hoping that you be comfortable enough to, to, to share some weaknesses or share some kind of uh, soft spots or just just so they can disappoint you. They know you strong, you know. They know you strong. They know you different. They know you unique. It takes strength. It takes strength to be strong. It takes strength to, you know, to be able to be yourself in a world where they breed followers. You know what I'm saying? It takes strength to, be, to do that. Most people don't have the strength to be themselves. Most people don't have the strength to to um, stand out, to be a, a outcast. It takes a, it takes a different type of creature. It takes a different type of creature to be able to walk along certain roads in life, the safe route, to think different. It takes a certain type of creature. You know what I'm saying? They think everybody got to act a certain way got to be a certain way, got to do the same things, you know. They want to find fault in, everybody want to find fault in a rainbow. They want to find fault in a rainbow. They want to find a blemish in a rainbow. In their, in their mind, you're perfect because you shine. But you're not perfect. You're just... You just was able to put yourself in a position so God can shine on you. Because without God shining on you, 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 you know, you ain't nothing. I'm not nothing. We ain't nothing. But you put yourself in a situation with your faith, your belief, um, you know, whether knowingly or unknowingly, you just put yourself in a situation to shine brighter than the average, than the average person. It's sad, but you know, a lot of people want, you know, they, they act nice, they wanna be nice to you. They act nice, they wanna be nice to you. They are not really good people. Some people that we call family and friends and coaches and teachers, they may not be good people. It might be jealous. They, they, their jealousy levels are high. Their demonic levels are high. You know what I'm saying? They, they want you to, you know, they don't understand, man. They don't understand. It's a lot of jealousy going on out here. It's a lot of comparisons going on out here. You know? So be careful who you get too comfortable around. Some of you guys already know that you learned at an early age that you just can't be a certain way around everybody. Some of us take longer than others to learn that you people gotta earn your your in, your attention and your energy. I'm Alan Ray, and don't just watch this video. Watch the rest of the videos and press the like button, subscribe button, and notification bell button. I like to give a shout out to all the people that's been donating to my Cash App and my PayPal for my father's funeral burial. Um, yeah, nickels and dimes add up. I understand everybody ain't got a hundred dollars. Everybody ain't got fifty dollars. Some people got fifty cent. Some people got a dollar. They all add up. We only got one week left to bury my father. Much love to y'all. Stay prayed up in Jesus' name. We out.